<laughs> my son definitely dictates everything. Ashanti's dream of having a child have finally come true. She and Nelly are clearly on cloud nine and Ashanti recently shared some heartwarming details about their little newborn. But it hasn't all been smooth sailing. There have been some nail-biting moments surrounding the birth of their son, and you'll honestly be amazed by everything that we already know about their precious baby. According to People, Ashanti first announced that she had given birth on social media. She took to Instagram to share a photo of herself wearing disposable underwear from a brand she partnered with called Freedom Mom. In the caption, she wrote that it was funny how life's plans weren't always on time. She added that she'd been waiting to be a mom for a long time, but nothing could have prepared her for everything motherhood brings. Some celebrities are super private when it comes to their kids and won't even let the public know their names, like Rihanna and Nicki Minaj. But that was not the case with Ashanti and Nelly. A rep for the couple told People that they welcomed their son, Kareem Kincaid Haynes, on July 18th, 2024, and that the proud and happy parents were so in love with KK. Ashanti usually doesn't like to share too much about her personal life, but I guess she's so excited to have her little boy in her life that she's more open to talking about him. In her interview with Entertainment Tonight, Deidre Bahar, she dived into the story about how KK got his name, and it turns out that all the credit goes to his dad. She revealed that Nelly named him with a lot of pride. They'd been going back and forth for a long time on his name, and he was very adamant. Ashanti thought that it was just so amazing, so thoughtful, and so sweet because Kincaid was her dad's name. And obviously, since her father only had daughters, Nelly said that it would be a nice honor to name their son after him. She swore that it was all his idea. I mean, it's a really sweet gesture on his part. Nelly already has four children, but this is Ashanti's first. So it's really cute of him to choose a name that pays tribute to her family. Apparently the name Kareem means kind, noble, bountiful, generous, and dignified. Ashanti wasn't afraid to get into the details of the day that her baby was born either. She gushed that it was such an amazing, incredible feeling and experience. It seems that he was born a little earlier than expected. This probably caused a little bit of panic at the time because Nelly reportedly wasn't in the same city as his partner when she went into labor, so he had to fly in at the last minute. Luckily, he made it well before she started to give birth. The new mom told E.T. that she couldn't help but cry when she saw KK's face for the first time. She described the moment as being so emotional and so spiritual. Ashanti has always been open about how much she's wanted a kid. In April, she told Essence that motherhood was something that she looked forward to. She confessed to Deidre that she'd been envisioning the special moment of meeting her baby for so long. She'd always wanted children, and she'd also always wanted to get married. She had to laugh as she admitted that she didn't know that she was going to spend the block and be with her ex from a long time ago. Even though it might not have been exactly how she imagined, you just know that she was over the moon that it finally happened. Ashanti explained that it was a moment with a lot of emotions happening at the same time. And she said that it was amazing just knowing that she'd met her person, found her purpose, and that this was what it was supposed to be. According to her, when it was the three of them together and they were all able to hold each other, it was such an electrifying feeling. She said it just validated all of that. It was very emotional and spiritual to say the least. When Deidre asked Ashanti if her baby resembled her or Nelly more, she shared that at first, Kareem looked more like Nelly, but a month on, he was like her twin. She revealed that she even dug up some old baby photos of herself to do a side-by-side -side comparison. There was reportedly even a bet between Ashanti and Nelly's families on who their child would resemble more, with Ashanti assuring the Haynes family that her Douglas genes were stronger. And believe it or not, KK is already showing mannerisms and personality quirks from both his parents. There's one tendency that he inherited from his father that will just melt your heart though. Apparently he sleeps exactly in the same position as his father, on his side with his hands folded. But there are also some things that Ashanti might not want her son to get from his dad, like his continual run-ins with the law. In case you missed it, Nelly was arrested in August in his hometown of St. Louis, Missouri, just weeks after the birth of his son. A report by People claimed that he was arrested on a charge of no proof of insurance and another charge of allegedly being in possession of an illegal substance. The rapper had been at the Hollywood Casino and Hotel, and he supposedly won some casino jackpots and was trying to collect them. The casino security supervising the transaction decided to run a search for warrants and they found that Nelly was cited in 2018 for driving without insurance and a judge had issued a warrant in 2023. The Guardian reported that after finding the outstanding warrant, an officer put Nelly in handcuffs and took him to the police station in Maryland Heights. His lawyer, Scott Rosenblum, alleged that the officer searched his client even though he didn't have probable cause to do so. He also claimed that Nelly was not charged with substance possession and that if he 
had been any other citizen, he would have just been told to address the issue and allowed to go on his way. But the arrest didn't seem to disrupt Nelly's life too much. Just a few days later, he made a surprise appearance at an MGK performance in Cleveland per TMZ. Like Ashanti, he has always spoken to the press about how he feels about becoming a father again. He told Entertainment Weekly, having kids is always a blessing and seeing how dope Ashanti is as a mother is awesome. I wonder if being a parent to another kid has changed him as much as it has reportedly changed his partner. While speaking with E.T., Ashanti shared that having a baby changed her because she realized that she was no longer in charge. Now, her son dictates everything and is her first priority above all else. She explained that she didn't care what it would take or what she'd have to do. She was just going to give her all to her son. He came first, regardless of anything. Ashanti gushed that whenever she'd look into his eyes or pick him up and kiss him, there was this overwhelming feeling of love and admiration. She said, this little boy has my entire soul wrapped around his finger. But now that she and Nelly have their baby, the next big question is, when will they have their wedding? In an older interview with E.T., the R&B singer teased that she knew which month she wanted to get married in, but that she wasn't ready to say yet. She was also pressed for details about what kind of wedding she was imagining, whether it was going to be something big and extravagant or something more low-key. She revealed that it was going to be a combination of fashion, glam, and Caribbean vibes. So it's clear that Ashanti does have some kind of vision for her upcoming wedding. But the bizarre thing is that not long after that interview came out, TMZ published some pretty shocking news. The outlet alleged that even though Ashanti and Nelly have said that they were engaged and planning to have a wedding, they were actually already married. The crazy thing is that the pair were reportedly legally married last year, around the time that everyone began to suspect that Ashanti was pregnant. Their marriage date was listed as the 27th of December, 2023. I guess they didn't want their baby to be born out of wedlock, but at the same time, they weren't ready to have a big wedding bash while Ashanti was still pregnant. This hopefully means that now that KK has been born, their glamorous wedding celebration will be just around the corner. But anyway, what do you guys think? Do you like the name the couple gave their son and the moving story behind how they chose it? Do you think it's a bad sign that Nelly got arrested just after the birth of his son or was it just unfortunate timing? Let me know in the comments below.